I'm out here at 778 Tanager Lane. This home is on a cul-de-sac and you do have a nice long driveway. You could fit easily four cars just right here. Here's the home. Here's the cul-de-sac here. And I don't know if you can hear or not, but so the highway is right behind these homes here, and that is Route 20. So you will hear that traffic. Um, I know a lot of times in communities and highways, they'll have like the barriers that go up along the highway. They may do that in time, but um, I don't see that happening for probably at least a year. But walking in, you have a little, I think this would be considered like the dining area. You have the bathroom right when you walk in. Really nice size. You have to put up a little blind there. You also have a coat closet immediately as you walk in. So here's the entryway. So coat closet, bathroom, little hallway, dining room. This is where your refrigerator would go. It's like a galley style kitchen. You have a um, dishwasher, microwave, your pantry's over here. You have room right here for, I would say three. Over here is your laundry room that also leads to the garage. Nice little nook here, kind of goes up. You have a fireplace. You have the stairs right here. You have a primary suite down here. Nice cathedral type ceiling. You have a shower here, bathtub. I'll have to ask to see what their plans are. This should be glassed in here. Here's the master closet and your toilet. You have double sinks here and a linen closet behind this door. And then walking up the stairs. So it's a nice size up here. You have a little loft area. You can hear the noise of the highway inside the house. Here's a little attic Oop. access. It's very hot in there. It just, just kind of goes around, which is cute. Okay, we'll go over here to a bedroom. Here is the closet. Nice big walk-in. Here is a Jack and Jill bathroom they have up here, which is super cute. leads to the other bedroom over here. So your backyard does back up to these woods here. 
which gives you a little bit of a buffer from the highway. So. All right, let's walk over here to another bathroom. You got double sinks. So there is no shortage, short, shortages of bathrooms in this house. Nice big closet. And another room with a nice closet. Nice linen closet here. And that is it. So you have space over here, bedroom, bedroom, that connects to the Jack and Joe bathroom, right here. And then on this side, you have bedroom, bedroom, bathroom. So four bedrooms upstairs and a primary suite downstairs. So this primary suite is what, is what eats up some of the layout down here, but it's still a really cute layout, especially since you have the loft area that you can use as a second living space. And then let me show you the backyard. As you can hear, this does have a nice little overhang patio area, nice size yard. So your yard would be pretty wide. So your yard would go all the way out to here on this side. Give you a pretty big backyard. And on the other side, you can butt your fence up to the neighbors since they already have one. There's a lot of flat ground over here. Over in this space, you would just connect it. There's the home.